It's a hot one. Uh, we are yeah, all right, in varying degrees melting. <laughs> something, something. Morning sun, midnight. Sun? What is the lyric that comes after that? Oh, uh, what? eleven inches from the midday sun. Is there that it, it is, is the midday moon sun. I, I, my brain went midnight sun, and I'm like, no, that's probably just because uh, I... that's from Roland the Thompson Gunner. Uh, <laughs> from Land of the Midnight Sun is where Roland hails from. Oh. Uh, no, Patrick's not going to motorsport. No, we're just hanging out. We we've gone through <laughs> uh, the the. We, we've, we've gone through the harrowing experience of our big annual renewal. It's still ongoing. A lot of people s signed up later. But a lot of our subscriptions are concentrated, uh, you know, for obvious reasons. June 1st, June 2nd, the day we stopped working at Vice and the day yeah. started, uh, mm -hmm. started Remap. Uh, but apparently, like, you know, spoiler, that went pretty okay. But we'll get to that in a second because what's not going okay is um patrick's air conditioning situation can you uh this, this is what i did um about about three weeks ago um the the we're gonna have like our first day that was approaching like high 70s that's not enough unless it's terribly humid to put the ac on in our house um unless someone else requests it uh because i tend to manage Ooh. that being that i work from home <laughs> jesus christ um but i was like oh it's it, it, it's only like 65 today good day to turn it on just make sure everything's working well. I pay to have it maintenance once a year. Um, you know, do the heating and air con You know, I do all that. I someone's looked at it, uh -huh. but I turn it on and I just hear, I, 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 "Rob, you've got a web browser open. Can you search for concerning AC unit noises?" All right, we'll just go top. <laughs> if, you go, if, if you go, no, if you go to oh, wait, YouTube, if you go, like it's actually. One. No man, YouTube. <laughs> Is it that one? If you go to you, yeah, here any of these. Five, do this one. There's five common AC noises and what they can mean. What you may hear. I'm not sure which one I started listening service. to. If you hear a grinding or screeching noise that sounds like this. That's what I heard. Worn out compressor or condenser fan. Ah. Oh, because that's just like a, a dead AC. Well, no, you don't want a dead AC, filter, Rob. Have you looked up how much AC units cost? Return vents. Uh, Patrick, so I have a dead heat pump AC in my wall uh, that I got the quote and I was like, I don't need that. <laughs> I, I turn it on. I hear a noise that sounds like the AC unit's going to explode. Mm -hmm. So I, I I I run inside. I turn it off. Uh, I call our, our 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 local folks that handle that, and they come out and they look at it. And what made it even worse was, um, I could hear him talking, but not. I couldn't hear the whole context of the conversation. The AC unit is just around the corner from my my office, and so I could hear him like calling in, like I don't recognize this serial number. I. Hey, J hey, like asking questions or, like, as I was doing it, I was searching how much does an AC unit cost to replace? And the whole time going, well, that I, I would have to replace it, but God, God, God willing, I, I will not because <laughs> AC, AC unit, like whole AC unit replacements, you start at like 3,500 and we're going up. Like with you just baseline is thousands of thousands six grand. of dollars. Right. And that's before the labor. Right. So your quote probably came with the labor included. Right. Uh, no, but actually the labor is pretty easy because like remember old building. One thing that I'm up against is we have weird, extremely old AC heat pumps, uh, which is why they're so expensive. Like there's one factory left in the world still making them. And so they can kind of wow. charge whatever they want because they've got this monopoly on old buildings. The thing about them is once you have the unit, you basically just slide it in. Like the the labor is mm -hmm. like once it just shows up, you just hand truck it in, like literally slide it into the wall, uh, do a couple hookups, it's good to go. It's the cost is all uh, that's the, that's the mercy of this, right? It's very modular, so the labor cost is very low. It's just the scarcity of the thing makes it very expensive. Yours, I imagine, is not a sort of plug and play like let it let it go situation. 
No, no, it's it's a big ass AC unit. It's you know, it's 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 old. You know, it's like I think they said it's like sixteen years old. But every time I get checked out, because part of the strategy is that I've been playing is look, at some point I will probably have to sell this or not sell. I don't think anyone's going to buy my AC unit. But if you're going to replace it, the the critical component to manage your cost, it's still going to be a big hit. But to manage your cost is to do it in the off season. You don't want to buy. I tested my AC unit. On the precipice of summer, on the beginning of the warm season, you know when the what the great time is to not buy an AC unit when they know that they have you by the fucking balls and you are going to have to purchase the AC unit. So instead, I work with my heating company. I'm like, hey, like let me know when this thing is on. The, like I need to know, like, hey, like a year from now, we think this thing is going to go, and then that winter. That's when you replace the AC unit when they're not moving any units yes. of AC units and you can save a little bit of, of cash. Yeah, we are going to be we, we couldn't do it this spring <laughs> because there is the condo assessment we had coming. So like, we just couldn't. The nice thing is it's our bedroom unit, which means that the portable AC unit can get the job done. Right. And actually, it was, portable so AC that was going to be my question better than our antique unit. Because I can't, like, I can't not replace that. It, like, it's the house. Like, I guess an alternative was just to, would be to, be to buy like seven window units and just strategically no, no, place them around it, the house. You're, you're, but that's not right. it. I would just be purchasing, uh, you know, a new, uh, a new AC unit. Well, um, hang on though. Hang I on. I think you. Yeah. What about the like this guy? He has five things AC companies don't want you to know how to do. And Patrick, I know you hate spending money. Yeah, it's true. Uh, I think maybe this guy, maybe it's this, one of these five things, maybe one of these five things is just like what you need to do. Yeah, you just got to clean your coils. Clean your coils. None of it. <laughs> I think my, my favorite thing, my favorite thing to do is to watch videos like this and go, I guess I could do this. I don't try, I, I, but I need, I need a guy. Like, and by what I need, I, like, I need a guy who like, I could watch this video and they could help me do it. You know what I mean? Like, I don't trust myself to sit and do this video, but if you had a guy that could just like look over your shoulder and be like, you are, you're doing it right, it's, Patrick. That is right. It's the, there's something like, it's, it's like someone can talk me through something as long as they are there and I can confirm that like, Okay, this is the next step, right? And they're like, yep, do it. I feel great. I'm like, yeah. all right, I got this. Yeah. If that person leaves, I lose any ability to continue moving forward on it because I begin second guessing and doubting myself, and it's over. Yeah. It's, it's just done. You know, I, you know, anytime I've done even just like mild plumbing work, my wife's, I'm like, oh, I found like, a, it's like a five minute video. Like, I think I can handle it. I think I can do this myself. Three hours later. What are you? What have you been doing for three hours? Well, I've just been rewatching this five-minute video, thinking that I'm going to flood the house, and I didn't. But I just, without the, the soothing sound, I'm sure for a lot of people, the soothing sound of the YouTube video functions as as the guy, as the person to be like, "You're doing this, buddy." Yeah. That doesn't exist. Like the the video pauses, and much like the person leaving the room, I am left in complete engineering paralysis, unable. To move forward with the basic task. I need to cut together like the me. ten minute video needs to become an hour long, and each sequence loops twelve times. <laughs> like that is that is it. Like each step, each you, step. You, you, step one, you you watch step one twelve times as you're doing it, and you'll have to wait a few seconds for it to loop back to the exact thing you're doing, and then you move on to step two. That's that's how these should work. Uh, Jeremy two nine 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 isn't Task Rabbit for that. Uh yeah. Um Task Rabbit when it goes bad it's bad, right? Like the like Task Rabbit's a real double edged sword where there's a lot of like really skilled handymen and like ex contractors and such on Task Rabbit and some of them are like, you know, diamonds in the rough where you can find mm -hmm. you can find a fucking guy on Task Rabbit, like with a you know, uh who can who can nail a certain situation. But there's also a lot of imposters out there. Uh you know, you got people who are like I specialize in furniture delivery, uh, assembly, you know, Ikea yeah. furniture, and uh, plumbing. And it's like, wait a second, where'd that plumbing come from? Which, which, oh, how's that, how are those all four comments? <laughs> what just happened? <laughs> oh, mal Malwarebytes is always throwing, like, stuff up. It's very aggressive. Uh, 
I hate, yeah, I, we, we've used TaskRabbit a couple of times. Uh, I'm, I, I feel like I probably told the story on, on HOA, but for the benefit of the broader audience, I, like, we were hanging a, a, a substantially size, like a 70 inch TV in our family room. And it was not, it was maybe a year into having uh, our, our youngest. So she was one. And I could not. Like, despite buying two levels of detectors that, like, one, one, like one stud detector that's like, this should be fine. And it has been fine for years to find studs in the house. But sometimes if there's old wiring back there, it can, it can mess up your ability to find the, the stud correctly. So I bought one that's like, this one, this is for the fucked up walls with wires in them, and you can find it. And I sat there with my wife. We could not, and I've hung TVs before, re, like, could not reasonably determine it. And I'm like, I am not risking the 70 inch TV with the toddler hanging there when we could just get someone that this will be trivial. And so I went on task rabbit and here's my, I wish they don't give you this option, Rob, but they should let you sort by age because I want, I want the grandpa. I want the old mm -hmm. guy. Like I want a crusty, a crusty man shows up, you know, I'll even accept like if task rabbit had like how much mild racism are you willing to tolerate a pretty decent amount actually if they can get into the house and take care of the problem so i looked if you basically sort by review that's actually kind of what you end up getting on task rabbit yeah. is by sorting by sorting by like amount of reviews you get like a guy who's been there a long time and chances are he's pretty old and so i found this guy he came out he looks at the situation and i had already done 90 percent of the work i was like i just don't exactly know where the studs are and he's like i get it and he you know did some tapping techniques he's like this is a tricky one we found it he halved the cost because he's like i didn't really do anything here today except just reaffirm your suspicions on on the studs and like thank you that's nice and wrote down his phone number um never really had a reason to follow up with him and then we were getting uh, a new lock installed like and then one on january like 6th you turned on the tv <laughs> oh no Eugene, what are you doing on the cap at the Capitol? No, we were getting uh uh there's a deal on a lock that like you can use your you know phone and watch and remotely unlock it. Like I was like, oh, it's half off. That sounds awesome. Uh but I we needed to shave down like part of the lock. I forget exactly the part of it, but like I was not gonna be doing any wood shavings. I didn't was not confident enough to be doing that. So I go on task rabbit again, go through the same methodology. Find somebody and like, oh, that seems great. Get that guy out here. Turns out it's the same guy. His name's not Eugene. We'll just call him Eugene for the sake of argument. And I realized as he steps to the door, I was like, God damn it. I used the exact same search metrics and philosophy to find a handyman. And I landed on the exact same one, like three Wait, years apart. Was it a different profile? Or you just had forgotten that it's No, like, I just had forgotten. I didn't I didn't put it together. Um and as he's leaving, I <laughs> It's like, hey, can I, have, uh, you know, how does this work? Like, do you prefer to me to just contact you on task grab? He's like, absolutely not. Every time he accepts a, like, yep. there's yep. payment structures for task rabbit to be like present in search. If you eat to even respond to a message to talk about a potential appointment, like, I think he said it cost him like $20 just to I ask me questions Holy about shit. the, well, I, I might be getting the money. Your memory count, but like, not just that. Yeah. Anytime you accept the chat, but then you don't book the job. If you're like, I'm not, this is not the right job for me. I, you know, what you're describing is sort of beyond my, that counts as far as task grabbers metrics, at least like the last ta tasker I talked to, uh, as like a failed contract. Like it didn't, oh my like, it God. Did, like a, like, like an unsuccessful, unfulfilled, uh, task. And so, yeah, the guy was like, you don't, he's like, obviously we would both prefer to talk about the scope of work in advance and what <laughs> expectations are if you both decide that like this job isn't going to work out or it needs to go a different direction task grab it hurts my business for that um like me being straightforward about like what, what my capacity is task rabbit is going to punish me for that and demote me and so i i asked you know what's the what's the best policy going forward he's like here's just my phone number like it's just contact me directly and i don't have to deal with any of that bullshit. uh and i'm just answering the phone number and you know like i'm sure androids do this too but like i'm answering my iphone number and as i get to the last two two numbers it's like oh you are you already this is listed you, in your phone as eugene the handyman and i was like i added this number 
three years ago, forgot about it, found the same guy, asked for his number again, added it, and just confirmed that Eugene was already in my in my contacts. You were doing it yourself though, right? Because sometimes I'll hand my phone to I'll hand my, if I want someone's phone number, I'll like open a new contact and hand it, just like type it in. And yeah. like I'm imagining that scenario where you've handed oh, far it more over embarrass to far more embarrassing <laughs> if I'd cost the man yeah it's like uh... money for his grandchildren <laughs> because I I had I was uh, too dumb to remember that we'd already done this this dance before that that said for all those very real problems with Task Rabbit for the folks that are on there like if you are looking for like just a local handyman like. I don't know, like where are they list? Like where are they listed? Where you're credibly going to get review? You know what I mean? Like TaskRabbit is at least functionally good at times for finding a person and then taking them and then carving them off the the service, which is yeah. what I've done with a couple. Of, like that's how we found our cleaning person. It was like there was a deal offered through the app. He was great, and then he was like, "Hey, I'm not supposed to ask this because it will get me booted off the service." But you seem cool. Can we just pay the same amount off the service and not use that service anymore? And I was like, perfect. Like that's that works out for everybody involved. So that's usually my interaction level with services like that is just it does fun, like it's clearly useful for uh, laborers to find business, but is bad like they are obviously exploited in terms of on like a per contract basis. So it exists in this weird fuzzy realm for me where like. Hmm, this isn't the best deal for the people doing these jobs, but also when I just need to find somebody, it's better than searching on Yelp or just people's like ramshackle websites. If they even have one, right? Like I doubt this, doubt Eugene has a website for me to peruse. And so TaskRabbit ends up being at least a decent way to get in touch with those people. The one, the one flaw with the, and, and this is maybe like, maybe it varies by trade, but out here, this is, it would be counterproductive to be like, um, crusty old white guy, uh, with the, with the mild racism stuff is not necessarily the thing you're precluding there is the fact that like a lot of the best young tradespeople are people of color or, uh, you know, uh, recent immigrants right and so the issue like the the issue that you run into there is like you're dealing with like the legacy family like hvac or plumbing <laughs> business and everything and they got you know th they've been around for a while uh and they start to have that built-in advantage but then like genuinely the, like the best the best work you're going to get frequently uh, will also be from a crew of like out here uh, north of Boston. Um, there's a huge Portuguese speaking community to the point where like every year I'm like, I need to just Duolingo Portuguese <laughs> to like just get through basic conversations because the ability to do a whole a whole world of possibility will open up to you if you can just muddle through a conversation in Portuguese, um, and you know that is that 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 is that is the play, right? Because any any like general contractor who's like worth salt, <laughs> well, this is this is where it started. I don't know if it's I don't know it's, not, it's less racism, it's more exploitation. A lot of general contractors will be like. Yeah, no, 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 no. If they if they speak English, they cost too much. Oh and I'm God. and and frequently the person telling you this, Brazilian immigrant who's just been around a little longer and who <laughs> does speak good English, and that is that is how <laughs> that's how it goes. Is like there is a pipeline of like the first wave of Brazilian immigrants here, like got enough English together to bring in second and third wave. And then it seems like maybe put the screws to them in terms of pay, like pay rates, uh, you know, where, where all the work is being done by people that like you can't really speak with uh, very easily. And then there's like a GC uh, who's who's running it. Um, now, yeah, that's now like, was, um, I'm, a, I'm a GC. My main crew that I use is Guatemalan. Also the most expensive. At a certain point, people do figure out what they're worth. Right. Yeah. And like <laughs> when you're when you're in that competitive booking thing, like people once people have no trouble filling their dance card and they can just turn down work because they know it'll fill up, that rate's going up. 
Pat Patrick. Yeah. Is the ace is the Am I remembering this correctly? Did you say the AC could capacitor? Is that the thing that you're having a problem with? No, it's not. It's okay. a um I was gonna say look, it's only a li- said, right? condenser. That's the that's condenser pump uh, it's well, cause it was like yeah. <laughs> Eleven dollars? That's so cheap. Even you can do no, that. No, the, the part, the part. No, I looked. I looked it up. Like the, the, it, it is, 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 um, you know, as we talked about elsewhere. Like Reddit is dying, much like the rest of the internet. But it is, like, I. It is always useful to go to some of those hobbyist subreddits, and there'll be someone asking, just like general purpose questions, like, like, hey, I got a quote for an AC repair for like this specific part. And you get a bunch of contractors like telling you like, yeah, that's that's that lines up pretty well. And like, I know that sounds expensive or, hey, you should probably get a second quote on that. And the I got like it's an older AC unit. So the part has to be shipped out. It takes like a couple weeks to get here, which is why it's not here yet. It's supposed to come in a couple of days. And so well, it should be resolved next week. So not nor, not normally am I glad that I'm leaving for Los Angeles, but at least I'll be away from my house for a couple of days when, when it's hot and I don't have to worry about it. My family will also be out of town on a separate trip, hmm. but the, all the, all the, all the Reddit contractors were confirmed that the price I was paying for the part and the eventual labor lined up, especially for early June where you're not getting a discounted rate. You know, the rate <laughs> is the rate. Um, it didn't seem like I was getting, you know, fucked over. It was like, yeah, that's just kind of, what it costs and a lot of that is also just like continued waves of like covid inflation like even if supply chains have gotten slightly better like costs have just gotten fixed up at certain certain rates. did you see the the the, the uh, there's I, I didn't read the article but it was just like target walgreens other places being like ah we should fucking just drop some prices yeah you see this yeah yeah <laughs> they're like well it's we we pushed a little too far i guess had to pull back <laughs> Well, and the other thing people are drawing the line too is uh, that a lot of resale companies also sparked the wave, uh, the panic around shoplifting and like uh, you know loss to theft, and like use that to push tough on crime policies, you know, greater police presence, and like you know the three things they push really aggressively are cutting staff, self checkout, and then price gouging, right? And so <laughs> you have like so wait you have you have a a self checkout line that's unmonitored, that's hard to work with to begin with, and kind of relies a lot on the honor system. Like, you know, item in bag air, bagging air. Fuck, you can do about it, machine. What are you gonna do? <laughs> what if? I, oh, what if I don't put it in the bag? What if I don't put it in the bagging area? What if I just put it down? You know, with like by a purse or something, like by by my feet. What are you gonna do? You gonna notice that? I don't think so. Uh, and maybe staff would, but you fired all those people. So like. <laughs> The the self checkout stuff like some stores some chains are like retreating from it and pulling and ripping out their self checkout lines because they are like express lanes to easy shoplifting during our many popular shoplifting discussions on Waypoint which people always loved uh, and always felt like we had responsible takes about um, one of the things that would come up is like you know, it required a little like you know sleight of hand when you're when, when you're shoplifting at the counter but self checkout requires no such finesse you don't have to finesse much um and then you created you made necessary items cost a ton and <laughs> like you know if you need diapers you know it's one of those things like is stealing bread really immoral if you're starving of course not no <laughs> well there was there was someone uh like in response, I like I clicked on like a you know on, on social media like a comments in response to someone linking to this these this articles going around like Target and Aldi and other places, <clears throat> just deciding arbitrarily also seems like collusion to also drop the prices simultaneously. Uh, but like there was a extension cord, and you know like oftentimes you go to a place and it says like the price was this, but now it's this, and usually that's seven ninety nine to five ninety nine you know some, some sort of like relatively minor minor change maybe a sale whatever what ha- off season what have you this was like like a six foot extension cord that was eleven ninety nine to two ninety nine like, like you don't just drop the prices that fast that far yeah. unless you've been like fuck it man what are people gonna do i you want that extension cord come get it so 
uh, it is funny that like prices are coming back down. Like that, that just that cracks me up. That they like they pushed it so hard that even all the market power they have, they still start to see like loss of customers as they go find stuff. Like, yeah. I mean, that's having a fast thing. food like, too, right? Like, I mean, I saw like McDonald's like in a quarterly was having like so. Huh. Turns out, like well, there is sort of a price cap on what we can do in the fast food market as well. Well, McDonald's is also being boycotted. I think pretty heavily so wait are they i missed this oh yeah they're not official bds but part of that whole like thing that got got up with I, I don't know how many people like are still abiding by it but like there was a moment there where it was like you couldn't touch the stuff <laughs> oh, i i didn't know that like mcdonald's like became a bds target um, yeah and, yeah not not officially that. but grassroots movements that bds acknowledged <laughs> yeah um i yeah, but like my understanding is they also push price increases really hard and they just like kind of yeah. lost the value proposition uh for, for yep. a lot of folks uh where it's like the thing that really makes it fast food work is it's like convenient and cheap complete meals and if it's no longer cheap well then you just got like kind of kind of pricey junk food yeah uh yeah it's like it doesn't surprise me that and like and that's a space where it's like there is competition, right? Like there may not be competition. Like there's not another McDonald's, right? But like push the prices high enough, and people will be like, "Yeah, I can do Taco Bell. <laughs> Taco Bell's pretty good." Or even just how, I could go Taco to Taco Bell a... prices, Ben. I'm not actually sure. I get I I I don't have the 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 most recent time I got it. I got that special thing with the big cheese in it. So I can't. It was a little bit pricier, but not by much. But I had a big cheese in it, in it so you know that's special. <laughs> I was gonna say at, the, at a certain point, at a certain point, they're they're getting they're inching towards the there's a local burger spot that will probably price price McDonald's out of, or like be not that big of a jump but be a better burger, right? Yeah, yeah that 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 is that that's the that's the other part of this. Um, Patrick, somebody pointed out a minute ago in chat that yeah. and I've I was advised to do this as well by the well so. The neighbor we've got has been remodeling forever. He does a lot of like contracting work other places, but he was like, he has a line on AC units for this building. Um, like okay. basically, he he doesn't buy through any local HVAC company. He does enough business that he can actually speak directly to, uh, like the purchasing agents for like the actual company that makes this shit. And so he orders like a few of these at a time and gets them sort of at whatever is like close to what the factory is, is charging. And he just put a couple on ice in his storage. Uh, Cause he was like, these things do fail regularly enough that like when he sees a good price on them, he tosses a few into storage um, and parcels those out too. Cause he, because like, you know, he's got a double unit. He has four of these HVACs in his place, right? So the odds of one of them failing in any given year, surprisingly high. Uh, but somebody mentioned, like, some of the more expensive parts, you might be well served by, like, finding out, like, find out what the part is that they're replacing. Mm -hmm. And, like, if you got the garage space for it, when the prices come down, if it's a part that regularly fails, might be worth keeping, like, the box part in the garage so that, like... Next time HVAC guy comes through, it's like, ah, oh, the condenser will let go again. <laughs> Boom. Well, there you go. Well, when our uh, years back, uh, like over COVID, when we had uh, our youngest and our, our washer and dryer were being like just used at astronomical rates because you're just, you know, the kids having accidents and puking on, and you know, I'm like, if you're just go, you're just using it even more than the rate we were already using it a ton. Uh, and when we bought our house, the washer and dryer came with were approaching 10 years. 10 years is like about kind of what you can expect from washer dryer units if you're doing like decent maintenance on them. And then it kind of becomes a how much is it going to cost to repair versus just replacing the unit entirely. Anyway, our washer goes. Got to get the washer fixed because th these clothes are disgusting. Can't hand wash them. And I ask this guy and we have a really great guy who comes out to handle that stuff. No bullshit is always like really good sort of like straight talk about like what's the condition of the unit? What should you actually do? What makes sense? And 
he's looking at the dryer. He's like, it's tough to tell when a dryer is going to go. Uh, he's like, but it seems fine. Like, he's like, my best estimate is like, you could get anywhere from a year to five years out of it. But you do save money if you buy them together. He's like, but it would seem sort of silly to buy them together <laughs> when you would just be putting a dryer in your garage for potentially half a decade. It's like, yeah, that does seem sort of silly. Yeah. I think I'm just not going to do that. Bought the washer six months later. The dryer went <laughs> and had to just buy it separately. And so I, I, I fully kind of get what your guy is talking about. Where like, if you just know there's a reasonable chance that something failing, the idea of storing the backup in some capacity is not an excessively silly notion. Because I ultimately wish we had done that. We weren't even using the garage that much. It was COVID. I, I, I fucking turned it into a storage unit. Who gives a shit? Uh, <laughs> I wish I'd done that because it would have saved me, I don't know, $400, $500 to, to buy it as a combo as opposed to have bought them separately. Yeah, it's well, especially because like just depending on what's happening, both in the market for the part and then also in the like appliance the appliance companies in the region, what's happening with their dance card. Like you end up paying such wildly varying amounts. Uh, to to get this done, uh, so Patrick, uh, we should talk about renewals. Uh, I yeah. would say so. I have a I have a confession to make, and this mm. this concerns you too, Kato. Mm -hmm. Um, Friday night, I tweeted about wanting to buy a typewriter. You did. I, I chose not to in, engage with the tweet because it was because it was the weekend and I saw it. It was it was point, pointed my way and I chose uh, mental health, my mental health, which was to not engage with that tweet. Um, not today, and, Satan. No, no, I will. I will simply let this is Rob's problem. It is not my I cannot. Well, it myself. became your problem because in the hour after I posted that uh, 120 people deactivated their subscriptions. <laughs> oh my god wow direct correlation that's wild that, yeah wow <laughs> no it's so it, that it was also in the window as because remember the yeah. renewals happened not on calendar date they happened to the minute from when people signed up yeah like the mm -hmm. the wave of renewal so it was it was just like the attrition we were gonna have from like the annuals not not ringing up again what beautiful but timing though <laughs> it was i was like huh thinking about typewriters anyway time to check the memberful dashboard <laughs> it's like oh fuck i crashed the plane oh my god uh yeah that's uh, true. That's true. That's tremendous. Rob, you are staring. You're staring at the data too much. We got we got to get you. We, we, <laughs> we you're looking at the abyss. <laughs> yeah, like I know they're like screen time restrictions for apps, for devices. We need a screen time restriction on memberful.com. But Rob, Patrick, right? that is also how I catch you returning money to the company by accident. <laughs> that's true. Patrick Patrick refunded <laughs> Patrick refunded his entire distribution from last month. What we uh, we, <laughs> we go over this every time. I, I don't know how often you guys like once we had company accounts. Like I'm sitting in like muttering the the final four numbers of an account yep, number to myself. Yep, yep, multiple times. I have three different the windows app, open. The so they don't. It's just like Chase business account, Chase business savings. Chase business account, Chase business savings, Chase saving. It's it's how it's listed. Yes, and a lot of times the screen I cuts I, off. Yes, let me rename them. Like, can if I could just rename them so it could just be this is what you are, little buddy. Like, give me a nickname <laughs> that's like like for these accounts instead. It's like seven four. Wait, no, that's seven four. Is that my wife's shit? And I'm like having to write down this spider web of accounts that I'm. It is different from like which disbursement is this? Is this the disbursement for the S corp? Is this the disbursement for the uh, the LLC? It's just I I haven't had none of us have made we even though we actively talk about stressing over the mistake it hasn't happened and then one I pre scheduled did like have an error 
which thankfully Rob Rob caught. Um, and then I was able to that, that was almost more stressful, Rob, because now I was going in reverse. Like, no, no, no. The way you've thought about these numbers is wrong because I need to get that money back there so then it can go back in the correct order to go here. Anyway. Yes. Uh, Ethan's uh, why- is that a photo of Tom Hanks? I assume that's because of uh, the, his prominence in the film California Typewriter, in which uh, it's a documentary about California Typewriter, a typewriter store in Berkeley, California, that Tom Hanks likes, or he likes at least... Tom Hanks likes typewriters. Okay. That was Is that a vault tech that. pillow? Yeah, that's Vault 111. What's Vault 111? I don't know. It's the, maybe it's the typewriter vault. The typewriter vault. Any of the distractions of Facebook, Instagram, Twitter. Vault oh, that's living right there, my friend. It's a, is a is a Vault Tech vault in the Commonwealth location. As I stated, Fallout 4. Anyway, uh, so yeah, but like that, you know, that's, that's, that is the upshot of me, of me staring at the numbers too much, but overall, like the, the thing that you always worry about, we talked about this before is like, mm-hmm. what if half the people who signed up to support remap right at launch are just like, I'm good. That would not be good <laughs> for us. That would not be like half is that, such that, a that, large that, number too. <laughs> like- but Kato, are you capable of imagining that half the people that liked you a year ago do not like you anymore? I'm capable of imagining that. I am, <laughs> not after... I am very capable of imagining uh, that. Not after... I mean, maybe normally, but not after watching our, like, churn never get past, like, 2% ever. <laughs> like, I feel like people keep coming back on the on the monthly. I was like, surely some of these yearlies are going to stick around. Or just transfer to monthlies if they need to, but... I don't know. I was less yeah. worried this time around, I feel like, than, than yeah. you were. Well, maybe it's like I also have to just, like, I can't, I have to be sufficiently pessimistic to make sure the good thing hap- You know what I mean? It's like <laughs> if I count on it. It's uh, the opposite of the it. secret, yeah. <laughs> yeah. This is what being a Bears fan gets you, is, like, you just have to know that, like, good things aren't going to happen. They aren't, they aren't possible. Oh, um, no. so- the, um, the, and, and related to all this, the, the funniest part is, you know, I, you know, I don't know if I call it a voice of reason, but a voice of caution when Rob is going down his particular rabbit holes. But when I found out the reason for the typewriter, rather rather than putting any stop to it, in, in fact, I was an enabler. I was like, oh, that's no, that's good. Actually, we should do this. That's you should. And that's Rob why I'm did. going to the typewriter store this Saturday. This yeah. Saturday, like, oh, we've got oh. a typewriter it tur- it, store. <laughs> oh shit! This turned <laughs> this turned this, this, turn, this tur- it turned from. Rob, like, is he writing old timey love letters to to his partner in the in the in the apartment? Too actually, I think this is turning into a corporate expense that I think we're going yeah. to. Like, I think I think we're paying for this. I think this is actually something we're getting. Kato, when you hear the when you hear the idea, you will. You'll I be know. Good. You'll be good. I know. No, 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 Kato, Kato, I oh, you know? about this okay. a, a yes. while back. Okay, yes. like okay, okay, because right. it was yeah, it was I was like this seems like a, it might be a neat thing to try. Ooh, look at these typewriters, but yeah, no, we have a typewriter <laughs> store in, in the Boston area. Um, wow, I actually. I lived near one, and I have actually this vague memory that we might have bought a typewriter from them at some point just because there was some like antiquated forms MK needed to fill out for grad school bullshit, and it was just getting easier to like just type some shit in rather than I can't remember. Like, I have a, I have a vague memory of going what? into Cambridge what? Typewriter. What? 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 what scenario exists where the typewriter makes it easier? Because, like, if you're dealing with an office that doesn't deal in PDFs, they don't like that. Like they, they're very spottily digitized and they're like, fill this form out and get it back to us. Sometimes it is easier just to like type into the form. Um, <laughs> okay. <laughs> I like, I, I have a vague what memory of having this? to do this. Uh, it was like a decade ago, like, you know, 12 years ago. Like <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> Nobody believes this. It might be fake. I might've made it up. I oh, do know. I do always, know that you can just scan an image, type it in the yeah, computer, type it in a computer, and then print yeah. it out. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> Probably. <laughs> I want to believe so badly, though, that like 
a, like an Adobe PDF oh. trial was rather was not considered, but instead a typewriter was purchased. Yeah, I I always forget that's a that's an issue on PCs because I've been a Mac person for so long. And like you just there is a built-in way to type into a PDF. On yeah, a, on you a have Mac. to pay for a fucking like like yeah. I I, I <laughs> because I have several trips coming up. I finally. Well, I bought a I bought a laptop. Like my iPad, my iPad mm. Pro is great for ninety five percent of my entire like day to day workflow. Right, and then the five percent where it sucks is like traveling, like and <laughs> dealing with air, like airport Wi Fi and stuff like that, and and uh, publishing on Substack like through the iPad is is nonsense. So I, I ended up buying one uh, specifically because I have like six flights in the next like four months, um, but. Also, uh, also, yes, now I have access to preview and can just, I can, I can just stop like jumping through weird hoops or like using a, a website that feels like it's scraping my data so that I can like add a signature. <laughs> I did that once and never again. It was like, that felt wrong. I don't yeah. think I should have done that. Yeah. Um, and instead, we'll just use the preview mode on, on, on my new MacBook Air. Um, which, those things are wild, man. They don't make a noise. The, I have there's the no last fan couple... to make a noise. It's just gonna overheat I, I, in your lap. Don't worry about it. <laughs> that's fine. I'll t- but like I am Dude, my, so, I, my my surface has gotten scary. Like the sheer number of times I'm now like, when is too hot a thing with a computer? Like it's real bad mm. when it's uh, when, when it's like under any kind of load on the back or like when it runs when Windows Update hits. I'm just like this thing's just gonna burst into flame. I think the MacBook Airs stay pretty cool, but it's just they don't. I'm when the one I had from Vice, which was a bad, it was a bad laptop. But I mean, all I had to do was open Safari and like have three tabs open, like 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 a cat like screeching out of my computer. And so these these new, I haven't had one that have had like what is it, the the M chips or whatever, like where they're just really powerful and really silent. But, yeah. Um, that's yeah, the nice. M4 chip. All right. Oh, All right, your Mac so and yeah, in your iPad Pro. All right, but yeah, the the renewals but, have gone. The renewals have gone well. Like, uh, I think we're excited. We will have more details to share on in a couple of weeks. We're gonna be doing a live show in New York. Rob, you and I. This isn't a formal meeting. We need to like book travel before book I go to LA. Yeah, probably. Should, <laughs> yeah, no, I'm still, I'm still, I'm still, I still think the right move. If the rates haven't gone up, I still think the right move you, is the I don't, is the Lux move. I need to, lo- I need to look at that because I just don't like. Just look it up. You're 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 probably not wrong, but also would Rob invent hotel rates to try and trap me into a scenario where I'm drinking with him until two or three of the morning, multiple nights in a row? It's true. Like that. That's also <laughs> possible. I just need to look up the rates myself before I commit myself. Well, we gotta to look up the rates, and we endeavor. need Kato to verify there's an easy subway because it's like one of those things. If it's like Bedford Bedford stop and then straight to the correct part of the studios in Manhattan, right? Yeah, are you looking at the? Uh, are you off the L? How close are you to the L? This would be looking at the veil. Uh, so like the the veil itself. So what are you? Basically. What are you doing? <laughs> what the fuck are you doing? Oh, it's a huge hotel. People aren't gonna like they're. <laughs> Remap fans are not gonna find Stop you it. and Stop like. It. Stop it! I, we're taking this off the call. All right, go go play water source manager. We'll talk about this later. I'm out of here. All right, bye. bye. Go. Don't. Bye. Don't. What's the, what? Don't. Are you healthy? Is your company solvent? Yeah, it's fine. Don't worry about it. Mm, okay. All right. All right. <laughs> I'll see everyone later. Bye. Bye. Woo. Our company is so solvent. <laughs> Oberhoff is doing so well. That's because we fired the good driver who cost money but didn't get paid for <laughs> just looking good. Yeah. And then we hired the drivers who were okay ish. Ish. Good enough. But are charismatic, and one of them eats a chicken sandwich real good. Oh, I forgot about the chicken ad. Yeah. Oh Can you go to take us to a card real quick? Yeah. Put us on the hold screen. I'll launch in. All right. <laughs> Feel like Remap lived another year, just like just like Oberhof. <laughs> just like, like Oberhof.
Oberhof went full the renewal's going capital. well. Was my uh, was was my what's her face being fired? Uh, sorry, retiring. <laughs> the age of re renewal. Uh... Whoa! What is for manager coming in a little hotter than I expected? Ah. Turn it down a little uh, bit. Yeah. It's the final few seconds before the. All right. We're back. So I have another grievance, Kato. Yeah. I bought new pants with suspenders. Uh-huh. But they didn't put the front suspender buttons in the right place. They put the buttons like clo like too close to the hips uh -huh. and not close enough to the front. Uh-huh. And so the suspenders don't like line up right. Oh no. And I'm like this is not Como Peaky Blinders at all. <laughs> like <laughs> we're, we're 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 fully out of the Peaky Blinders zone. No. No. <laughs> Seen Peaky Blinders, you know, in my opinion. <laughs> Necesita uh, mas Peaky Blinders. Yeah. <laughs> so, like, it's going to be right, Rob out here looking like a big A. <laughs> exactly. Exactly. So now, now I got to get the new pants. I got to take them to a different tailor and have that uh -huh. sorted out. Oof. Um, yeah. I mean... I do. I, I I try sorting this out myself, but I don't want to be like taking a needle and thread to my brand new pants, right? And like, can I get a button on a pair of pants? Yeah. Can I get the button on like really tight so it doesn't feel kind of loose and everything? Right. That's a little harder. Yeah. Like, do a really nice job on a button that's gonna like suspender buttons take a lot of load. It's not like a shirt button where right. like once it's buttoned, it just sort of is like in in place. The suspender button's doing a lot of work. Yeah. Totally. I think. Ink blot that. Surely paying somebody to move two buttons for you couldn't cost too much. No, it's not. Like good good laundry services will will take care of this too for for a song, but it's just annoying to have to do it. It's like how do you fuck this up as as a, as a tailor? Just annoying enough. You know, I'm going to bring down it's a little it's a little hot for me as well, actually. <laughs> Coming in too strong on the uh Oh god, I completely forgot to tweet this out. Did we tweet anything? Did we tweet? I didn't tweet. Did we tweet anything? I don't think we tweeted anything. Chat, do we tweet? Do we tweet do we tweet for blue sky? <laughs> do we tweet? Do we tweet for blue sky? <laughs> We did not tweet. I got YouTube and Twitch app notifications. This is just the notification. The notification. Uh... Not even a single toot. Not a toot. Not a toot. Not a skeet. <laughs> not Blue a <laughs> social. <laughs> Blue. Oh, let's see. How many people are watching right now? It's no. not bad. Not a chost. We don't use chost enough. We don't chost enough. Ch I need to chost true. more. I need to chost our funny videos. Yeah, if we used if we used chost more, maybe there would be like a chost community for remap the way there is for uh, for AMCI, where all the like chost has got like where all the full the cool fan stuff bubbles up uh, for AMCI. Nice. It's the one, it's the one outlier with. Uh, with that space where it's like, okay, something completely different is happening on shows than is happening <laughs> elsewhere. Yeah. It feels like the right sort of uh, subject for it, too. You know, people want to make posts and talk about it in that slightly yeah. longer form way, you know? Makes sense. Look at, look at this dweeb. Um, I'm concerned about the state of the team's finances. $195,000. We're, we're in the... Black is good, right? <laughs> yeah, black is good. Red is bad. <laughs> We're in the black, my friend. Le Leonin? Leonin? I don't yeah. think I knew his first name was Leonin. 
Yeah. Leonin Mena Garcia. Hmm. <laughs> Leonin feels like a name that's trying too hard, right? It's like... I don't know, just too imperial to, to me. <laughs> uh, it's definitely... It's giving royal. It's giving nobility. <laughs> yeah. Oh, we, we so it's 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 game day, Kato. That's it. We're we're in it now. Oh, is it time to just go on this one? In progress. It looks like we're going to Munich. Cool. I hope we have parts. We, we have parts. Do you? Uh, we do, but we don't have anything going. Uh, so we could design something. Ah! Excuse me. What do we have coming up? Milan. Breaks. God, wouldn't it be great to have a new engine? It would be amazing to have a new engine. Can we do a new engine? Team owners hate it when you do this. When you do a new engine. What's our sponsor situation? Yeah. Yeah. But hang on. Uh we were we saving for something or do we we were. We were. Were we? Yeah. We got the design center coming. Oh, yeah. the helicopter. The helipad. Right. That that, unlocks that's our, gotta be... Um, yeah. That unlocks the best sponsors. I don't know, do uh, you want the boss to yell at us some more? <laughs> yeah, let's fucking do it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we don't have enough money? How about this? Spends it on a new Yeah, check engine. this out. Wait. Hey, what, 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 what parts do we have? Look, our engine isn't at great level yet. Well, I don't think we can get it there. Um, right? Really? Because we don't have the facilities. We, but we can get to good, right? We're still on average. We can get to good. All right, we have four gearboxes. We really shouldn't build another gearbox right no, now. No, gearbox is fine. And then it, how many brakes did we build? Built one set. Okay. Um. Maybe we need an, another set of brakes, and that's yeah, the, the, the good thing to do. But I really want to build a new engine. <laughs> I know, man. Even with improved gearboxes, like our gearboxes aren't very good. No. Um. We need more. Yeah. Our engine's getting there, though. Yeah, it, it's getting there. But what if we got it there for, like, yeah. more? Yeah, I'm with you. We we should definitely... We need another one. Yeah. Look, you know, wouldn't it be awesome to just move... Because this spoiler's not even usable right now. This thing's a piece of shit. I mean, we have been you using know? it. <laughs> we have been using it, but, like, it, it sucks. Let's yeah. Just, let's build a nice spoiler. Sure. Doesn't take too long. Four eighty is comfortably ahead of anything we've got, right? Yeah. There's no reason to make it illegal. We want to use this one. <laughs> Damn, spoilers are expensive. make some money all right so this is acceleration crucial not good for us nope seventh or above fingers crossed <laughs> yep <laughs> Ooh, medium tires don't see those very often Yep, that seems about right. Yeah. You still can't. Yeah. Yep. Oh, that's as far as we got with the engine? Yeah, we have to take it out for a second. Did we run that engine? I don't think we've run this engine before. Okay. But we gotta. We gotta. Are we giving it to Gaspar or Claire? Uh, let's give it to Gaspar because I don't think he's going to finish the race on this engine. What? 
That's a 62% engine, man. Yeah, like, it's fine. I grave concerns. Grave concerns. Rain. We need to check our pit crew. Oh, yeah. Open, open that up real quick. I think we did this. I think we saved ourselves the headache. Yeah, and we decided to leave Bystrick in there for the moment. Yep. Yeah, for now. Yeah. All right, looked like everything was good, right? Yeah, one more. One more round with those people, and then we'll swap them. Zero stop. <laughs> 28 laps. What a weird... Ugh. Looks like a weird little monster. Yeah. It kinda looks like a, like a Pokemon. Oh, what's the name of that Pokemon, chat? You know, the one that's like a sea anemone? Anemone. Anemone. Let's just say it's a UI bug. Because we've, we've picked two drivers, right? Yeah. There's no way to not go in with both cars, right? Right. I think. Alright, this is... Where is this again? Germany? Something? Lily. Is that it? Is it a fucking Lily? I'm gonna pull this up. I think we are in Munich, right? Yeah. Uh, I don't see Munich in here. There we go. Mid Parisi. Hey, well, it's just somewhere. Place to start, at least. It's like, what if one of these was, like, bent over at the neck? Yeah. <laughs> you see that? <laughs> What's the... Hang on, the tire estimates here. 10 to 12 laps, 14 to 16. Okay. Medium goes considerably further, but, like... The Man, speed the, is a lot. Yeah. Speed's a lot different. But still, what, what are we, uh, how many laps is this again? I don't remember. Um, where are event details? Doesn't give you that. Shit. Okay. Hub? No. No. I think it was like 28 or something. It's fine. Well, we can oh, worry no, it's about not that. Gonna next time. Is not, it's not going to let us go through. Well, maybe it will. What yeah. if Claire's not there? Oof. Okay, thank God. But this fixes our issue that we were having where Claire would have a setup yeah. and then the setup yeah. wouldn't work for the other car and yeah, all that love it. bullshit. Love it. Was it Gen 3? Is Lily Gen 3? No, nah, Lily is like... 5? 6? 5. 4, maybe. I'm just saying all the numbers. I feel like it's past three. I don't think it's three. It's gen three? Fuck off. I never played three, so I don't... I'm gonna tweet. Tweet about it. Twoopski. Oh, don't forget to bring Belland in. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's Bieland, please. Mm, right, Bieland. 
Is there a... What's the closest uh, Ikea furniture? There's one around here, like... Um, I think there's a couple. Like, one serves North Shore, one serves South Shore around Boston. <laughs> oh, sorry. I meant... I I, should, I didn't finish that sentence, and I should have. What's the close Like... Like, what Ikea furniture is closest to Bielin's name? Is there a Bielin shelf unit I can get? There has to be. I never really made your choice of fossil book on Ruby Sapphire. Yeah, I never played Ruby Sapphire or either of the remakes of those games. Oh, can you paste the uh, YouTube link in, Kato, to uh, oh, yeah, yeah, Discord? Yeah. That's a pretty strong start, though. That ain't bad. It's not bad. Uh, there you go. uh, let me just finish posting this. Uh, can you uh, paste that over into Twitter? Because my Twitter client's broken on this phone. Yeah. All right, I will. I will mess about with uh, with this dude's car. All right, so. Let's just try this. You know? Yeah, give it a shot. Get out there, kid. That cornering feels a little far, but let's see what direction we go in. That's, that's funny that this says outlap. <laughs> this should, it's just, just, it's just in lap. Oof, got her just in time. Nice. Yo. Hell yeah. A tough one. Ooh, I like that. Because we have plenty of space on the, yeah, to the inch those back in. We get a little bit of space on the cornering. There we go. Let's try this. Sounds good. We're gonna have to pull those back a little bit, maybe. Ooh, nice, nice, yeah. Maybe, great can be so, it can be surprisingly wide, you know? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, let's try it. Yeah. I 
I think she needs to get some soft compound running. Oh, wait, Patrick tweeted. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> A well oiled machine. <laughs> Patrick tweeted. Thank you, Patrick. What, chat told us we didn't tweet. We trusted you, chat. Well, unless, we, unless, just... unless Patrick tweet, cause, unless Patrick heard us saying we didn't tweet, and then Patrick hand, handled it. I think that's what happened. But also, uh, chat, chat's been here the whole time. They didn't see the tweets. Always been here, sir. <laughs> and I've Sorry, been here the whole breakfast, time. All time sketch. <laughs> Angle of the sun has changed enough that I am now in darkness. Oh, do you have like a, a little like Cyril Karn situation in your office where it's like you have the brief <laughs> passage of the sun through your window? Yeah, then, basically. Yeah. Uh, it's good because I don't want direct oh, sunlight. Oh, yeah. Woo, oh, we got a real special shit. race coming up, folks. Hell yeah. We got a real special race. Balk nasty, it's like Gogurt, but to stay. Every line is a every line in that is like ridiculously quotable. It's disgusting. <laughs> so I'm gonna gamble that great on cornering is in between these two, right? I mean excellent. Excellent. Probably. Probably. Yeah. Shit. You can bring suspension stiffness down though, right? Get handling back. Yeah. Ooh, 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 ooh. <laughs> Doing the little dance. Oh, so close. I think tire camber though might get us there. Yeah, hang on. Almost. Ooh, I like this. We can try this. Yeah. 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 That seems great. Sometimes it's not that far off from, from great, you know? Excellence. Yeah. line is stuck in my head like the community line did you know gogurt is just yogurt <laughs> <laughs> oh bring in uh ellen yeah valley yellen yeah. Uh, well no the other one <laughs> the one who the other one <laughs> she has a name not to not tally yellen Oh, oh no! That's uh, we lost. We lost an excellent. Lost right. two excellents. No, we lost two greats. Two greats. Oh, we so found we moved the wrong direction. Yeah, we kept the excellent at least, so that's good. We can manage it. Nice, yeah. Something that like that feels possible. Yeah. Now how are we gonna get speed balance back though?
One more tick there. Yeah. Tired, tired. I wonder if Handley moved the complete wrong direction. You think you think it went the wrong way I or wonder overshot? If it did. Yeah. Yeah, that's the thing. I don't I don't really know. Well maybe take suspension down Let's and try see. this. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Sounds good. Don't forget to. Oh, we missed Bieland. Goodbye, him. Bieland. It's this damnable heat, Kato. <laughs> like, there's it's no pretty air. Bad. <laughs> yeah. It is pretty bad. Ah, uh, Congrats, Bieland. You made a PB. Wait, none of those other ones counted. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> and neither will this one. <laughs> I hate that someone in chat told us that 100% optimum balance is technically possible. By the way, I don't know who that was. Yeah, You've cursed me for life. You've cursed me for life. <laughs> What's Tally doing out here? So is this a safe place to talk about the fact that I said fuck it, I'm getting an Apple Watch too? No. What? Oh, I mean, yes, but no? <laughs> but yes? <laughs> Why? I can't figure out. Yeah. If it's, I'm still in the return window. Mm -hmm. I can't figure out if it's the best thing or worst thing. Yeah. I mean, there's things that are, there's things that are just nice. The big thing is, um, the, uh, decibel meter, just like flagging when noises are too too loud. Huh. Uh, do you know that when Tilly barks, oh, no. it hits ninety five decibels reliably? That's not. That seems bad. From wherever it's she not is. Great. <laughs> when Tilly goes full asshole mode, mm -hmm. uh, she like I've always been like, oh, that's piercing. That's really. I feel like I'm being brutalized by the dog. Yeah. Uh, and it turns out that just having a just having a, a live, uh, I am sure your your iPhone could ma uh, could measure it too. Uh, Zoe three D blast. There's certain features that Apple just reserved for the watch just to drive watch sales. Mm. Um, Apple's also really convinced that like it does. There's this a lot of divers out there. Like that's that like genuinely like their top end model is just like it's a diver it's a diver's watch and I'm like what how many di how many people go diving on the reg um hey look at that <laughs> Clam Watson maybe this is a problem that solves itself isn't hearing loss frequency specific <laughs> oh no <laughs> uh. So, there's like cool stuff like that, but the thing that I'm actually, I can't figure out if it's good or bad for just like the low level anxiety of a work day, uh -huh. is that tons of little pings hit the watch now. Right. And I can immediately just see and what's going on and then dismiss it. 
right. there's no question about like what's coming into the inbox or what chats are out there. Like I'm always plugged into it. Mm-hmm. And on the one hand, that's like a lot of little pings, right? And I'm like, oh, life has too many pings. There's too many little alerts. Too many. But pings. on the other hand, the ability to just be like flush that out of your mind of like, did I miss anything? Is there a chance that there's a chat out there that was urgent and I missed it? Right. That's kind of solved. And so I'm like, is it a net good or a net bad? I can't figure it out. That, hmm. I guess it depends on the balance of the anxiety of missing something versus the slight annoyance of having to look every like couple of seconds or, or having the urge to look because it's like vibrated slightly, right? Right. It's yes. The sheer number of times you get like a little bit like I just got a, uh, a uh, little like little pain. You get that little spike of like, oh, gotta look, but then you can like yeah. immediately flush it. Right. And the, the immediately flushing it thing is different than like knowing your phone is just like loaded up with notifications that you gotta catch up on. Sure. That's yeah. like that part is nice. I didn't know Dagger had an account. What a little what a little asshole. I hate what this guy. I'd love driving that beautiful <laughs> pseudo racing car. Well, I really learned Our something team has practice. money, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> God damn it, Dogger. Grigory, now Grigory. Gr- Grigory's a number one fan up here. Just tweet, just tweeting emoji. Uh, ha- hashtag go Oberhof Racing Team. Uh, smiley face emoticon, smiley face emoticon, smiley face emoticon. Not emoji, emoticon, you know? The, the, the little colon D, colon D, colon D. <laughs> That's a real fan right there. Oh, we didn't do a great job prepping this race. These bonuses suck. We should have had Claire working way more intensively. Yeah. Hey, look, medium tires. Is this... Not useful here. No, it's not. Oh, we got so close. All right, Kato, let's let's lose our shit here. <laughs> All right. Can we wait? This can we? Great. Did we save? Um. Bielens. We can save it now. Let's save it now. Can we load it just for comparison reason? Okay. Oh, triple X. Yeah, okay. I see. Yeah. Yeah, the vision. <laughs> okay. All right. Now. You want to load this setup. Yeah, yeah. Just to compare it to this And one. just see how it compares. Yeah. Excellent. Where the fuck did it save? I think I saw it further down. There it is. That's okay. pretty far off. It's pretty far off. That's, yeah. Not gonna be, but the handling might be right, which was further to the left. Yeah. All right. So let's see if we can just figure out the way to tick handling just a little bit left while leaving other things in place. Ooh, 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 Damn. yeah, I like it. I like it. Yeah, let's do it. Looks great. I Seventh get, is part stripping cumulative? Like, if we strip reliability at this point, is the reliability stripped for the next session? Yeah, it's stripped forever. Yeah. I'm pretty yeah. sure. But we also get the performance forever, right? Yeah. It's just like, I, I don't want to start. I don't know. I feel like we always Does strip. quality do wear and tear? I, I mean, yeah, the car is being used, no? You would think, but I don't know when the game decides to... Benish, there's no reliability to worry about for anything other than the race. No wear and quality. That's... 
No so where? So we should be stripping it down. That's some bullshit. That's not how cars work. <laughs> yeah. Just take that take that big old overall slider and crank it up a couple ticks. I don't know, man. Nice. Yeah. Well, because it only takes from the, the highest first. Yeah, I know. But like, boop, come back there. Nah. We can go to 70. It's crucial. That's fine. That just means we need it. And we have it. Yeah. That seems good. That seems good. Yeah. You can repair between qualifying and race? Really? Yeah, permanent loss of max reliability, but also a per permanent performance gain, right? Like the performance gain doesn't go away when we start the race, right? That would be that would be so unintuitive to me. <laughs> All right, I think we're good. Is it gonna rain today? Lightly cloudy. Oh my <gasps> god. Holy shit! We everybody need to go. Everybody out! Everybody out! out. Go, go, right go, go. Now. go! Now! 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 One, go! Go! Two, go! Three, four, five, go! 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 Run! Run! <laughs> Holy shit! Uh, automate Quintus's mini game. Oh no! No, we're you can't do, a, do. We're gonna do both. No, Rob. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know about this friend buddy I don't know about this one <laughs> oh my god he's seeing the code chat he's seeing the code <laughs> first spider holy coming shit. down holy shit overheated oh no oh you're good you're good it's happening it's happening Oh my god. Oh. Ah! <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> no, the water, it's wet. It's already wet. How did it? Oh my god, we should have we should have waited. No, hang on. Hang on. It now we're we're being passed oh, on, with dry. people on inters. It's yeah, it's gonna dry yeah. out. Oh no! I thought we. Yeah, I was with you. I thought we had more time. I didn't really realize what time the rain was gonna start. Yeah, only two minutes in. Shit. Wet enough for lights. Yeah. Oof! 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 Uh, we used a. We burned a set of softs. Ay, ay, ay. Kato's dismayed the water it's wet is a very <laughs> clippable moment. This is we've uh, entered another beautiful motorsport manager. Uh, another another bit of the cannon has been added. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Soaked. That track is soaked, baby. Woo! There's gonna be no track grip either. No, we're gonna have to send them out on the on the fresh softs. Okay. What is the what is our? Oh my god! Do they do their out laps at like three minutes? It's a long lap. Right. This is what I'm saying. But by the time they're back all around, should their flying lap be when it's mostly dry? At yeah, that point. it should be. We should send them out with like two minutes. Because at two the minutes thirty, two minutes fifteen. Shh. Mm. I was gonna say three. Two minutes, minutes forty-five for Fuentes. Two, I, I think we yeah. want to. 
Okay. Cut okay. it as fine as possible, right? Yeah. Sure. Two thirty is fine. Okay. It's drying out. Luckily, it's very sunny now. Two forty-five for Fuentes. Two thirty for Tally. Yeah. yeah. I hate to do this, but I think we have to send the modern fresh ones, right? Yeah, I do, I do think so. I do think so. Although, man, I would love... Well, they're not going to get to Q3. Like, they're just not. You don't think so? No, I don't. How much is the performance hit per percentage here, though? Maybe we could sneak... Yeah, maybe you we want to try just try to hold on to a tire. Yeah, yeah, let's try. It's one says anyways. Like we're not. It's probably not going to be the make or break with them anyways. God damn it. The handling is still off. Yeah, I think it's another tick to the left. Ooh, so close. <gasps> yeah! There. Yeah, yeah, this? yeah, yeah. Yes, yes, yes. I love this. I want to believe. Yeah, I want to believe. Let's believe. Let's believe. 20 seconds? Wait, why is it 20 seconds? Yeah, wait. Oh, cuz we're doing we're doing setup changes. Fuck. Okay, undo them. Undo them. <laughs> Just hit use setup on the last one. Shit. I wish we had done three minutes. <laughs> oh. Oh, pull back on Fuentes. Yeah. Oh, shit. Chasing brakes did not treat me well there. <laughs> yeah. Dry. The water is... It's dry. <laughs> the water on track is dry. God damn it. <laughs> Fucking Stephenson. Get out of here, Stephenson. Wee. Yeah, get him, Tally. Nice. Nice. Ah. Oh, we're good. Oh, we're good. Oh, we're fine. Oh, we're in this. Yo, we're in this. Are we in this? I think Tally's in this. Hell Unused yeah! Unused tires. <laughs> Unused tires! Unused Both tires! Nice. Nice. Woo! 
fucking stalker. God damn it. <laughs> okay. Oberhoff is settling into their final shape. <laughs> Okay, let's, let's, let's take a look. send her out unused with that new setup we wanted to run. Right, yes. That's that's a great idea. I was also going to say we should definitely check. If we, we want oh. handling to go over Skosh to the left, right? Skosh to the left. And we got it there. You got it. You had a beautiful... There's going to be a light drizzle. Small blip of rain, but then plenty of time mm. to, to do a couple things. Yeah. I think right now you can you send her out for this, this adjustment, and then we yeah. just wait until afterwards. So I believe it was partially a tick on uh, the ballast as well that helped us get there. I believe Wait, he, he moved on, that. Yeah. And then something else brought the cornering back slightly. There we go. Yes, it was like this. Yeah, yeah, just a skosh to the left on the handling. That should hopefully get us the... Yeah. Use the... Oh, I was going to say, use the more used up one. Yeah, and let's... Let's get... Let's get one in the bank for Fuentes as well. Yeah, just to see. He'll just go right up because he's not making a change. Yeah. yeah. Fake IKD. Jesus only loves winners like Dogger. <laughs> oh, a devotee of the prosperity gospel. Oh my god. When you're looking good and you're feeling good, that makes God smile. Who's the big prosperity gospel guy who like drives the Ferraris and shit? He's like the famous prosperity gospel guy. Oh. Nice, nice, nice. Joel Osteen. Joel Osteen is the one, yeah. Like, his quotes, like, some of the shit, like, he sends some of his sermons is just jaw-dropping. Like, it's incredible. <laughs> when, he, when he's basically just like, God likes it when you're dripped out. <laughs> and he hates it. He hates it when you can only afford your to send your kids with the brown bag launch. He thinks you're a piece of shit. Wow. Also thinks your kids suck. Wow. That's basically, in so many words, that, that he just goes fully there. Oh my god. Like we go from we go from camel through the eye of a needle to uh heaven is for closers. <laughs> they must have coffee in heaven. One forty point four seven eight. I don't remember what the times were like last time. Ooh. Harbor Moose, I'm a Jew, and I think uh, Prosperity Gospel is the wildest misreading of Christianity possible. It could only happen in America, I think. I, like, I think it could only happen in this country. Yeah. In this time. Because, like, it fills the need perfectly to, like, still say, I'm a follower of Jesus Christ. Like, I'm, I believe in God. I'm a good person. While also leaning fully into, like, the most violent materialism uh, and, like, social Darwinism possible. 
Like it's not compatible with Christianity, but it needs to be so prosperity exa uh, uh, gospel exists. All right, let's see what how Tally did. <sighs> that was better though, because we're at ninety eight versus ninety six percent optimum balance. So that was the right direction, it seems. You think we have time for one more and then an actual full lap? If she does the change now, right about now, I think we got time. Yeah. But I'm actually almost tempted to leave it here. We're at 98%. 98%. Like, yeah, it's good. I think yeah. I think you're right. I think you're right. I think you're right. I think we just wait and have a good actual shot because Remember, these times were tainted by being yeah. rained on. Being rained on. Oh wait, he's. Oh, there's go. gonna be more rain. There's gonna be more rain. There's, yeah, there's rain at the end. He's fuck, gotta go. Fuck, fuck, fuck. All of them. Both of them have to go. Yep, he's just gonna go out first. Yep. Hi. Wow, what happened to Stephenson? Did he also get hit by rain? Yeah, yeah. At least it's just the outlap, right? Ah, Fuentes. Woo! Huh, okay. Oh, hey, Fuentes. Okay. Shit. Go away, Rain. I don't know. This is this is really good. Nobody's gonna laugh, and no, everyone's in the pit. Everyone's in the pit. Yeah, but are we gonna actually make up the, enough time? Is it not gonna get too off in the wet? first two sectors? Ah! That's true. That's true. It's actually really good to only be there. But is this this last sector feels like I feel like it's gonna kill us. Oh shit. Fuck. Fuck. God damn it. Oh my the rain God. fucked we us! We almost had it. How did the rain fuck us? We're supposed to be the rain gods. <laughs> oh. oh boy. That's brutal. Yeah, we uh, needed to go the, right the immediately. Yeah, coming the back. Water, I, it's wet. Water is wet. The water is wet. God damn it. Well, and you know what else? Uh, you know what else we fucked up here? The tracker only goes to zero minutes. We ran most of this after zero. Right. It was just gonna get wetter it was from just there. Get wetter from there. And we're like, we're gonna be running on like a slightly damp track at the end, rather than we're gonna be running into a rainstorm. Right. God damn it. Right. Oh, well, so much for our money. Kato. Yeah. We ran that talentless rich boy. We got our money. This was just <laughs> bonus money. Yeah, that's true. That's true. We got money. We got money. Stephenson. Wow, 
Wow. Day three, fully dry. No rain. Neat. That's cool how that happened. I'm really happy for the other drivers and the other teams and the fact that they got a totally dry qualifying that didn't affect their scores at all. <laughs> uh... We'll get him on a race, die. Yeah. Yeah. Why is everyone talking about Dogger? <laughs> Where are the tweets about us? This the is our game. We're, is like, we're the main characters. <laughs> I feel with changeable conditions. Wait, is it raining? This Hold on. Hold on. Yeah. Is yeah, that what's going on today? Oh my god. It's dry out. It starts off wet. Will it stay though. dry? Will it stay dry? Yeah. Who's to say? But it starts out wet. So we should go out in inters, right? It's only, it's not going to be very wet. It's already damp, though. Like, we're starting from damp. I think we could just, I think we just go out on softs no absolutely not dude think that's about gonna... think, think about it this way seven laps say seven a bunch laps. of people say a bunch of, no but it's mostly dry that's that's not even inters there's only two laps there there's the two big the the big prominence there that's inters territory not Barely. even not damp damp is not worth inters no okay. damp is not worth inters this is like I think because my, my thinking is some people will start on inters and will pit early and we will start on softs and we will blitz it as it dries and go in with a gap. What if what if fuck a soft what strategy? Yeah, we got the medium tires light footed. What if we just give them medium tires the whole time? What's her knowledge? Her knowledge is race trim and so he uh, should be so so put ga Gaspar on mediums. Well, but also on in his knowledge, I guess it's the same, isn't it? Five percent. Okay, yeah, it's five percent. Never mind. The, the, we also got medium tire knowledge uh, that yeah. I thought we might as well double down. But no, yeah, he because he's got the light footed mediums. What if? Yeah, he goes yeah. out on mediums. We do. I mean, it's gonna be a one stop, obviously, with the with the yeah. medium tire wear more slowly. Yeah. <laughs> obviously. Does that feel right? There we go. Yeah. Right, that feels. Yeah. Safe. Yeah. Yes. 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 And then have her go softs. If she runs into trouble, we can always charge the battery. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, you know what? Let's just save this. It's a good one. It's still good. 98% ain't bad. And then we just have them kind of start safe, right? Like, yes. don't push it too hard. Just neutral. Just. It's the fucking tortoise in the hair. Neutral? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Fucking low and low and slow. We're not flash frying out, out here. We're, 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 you know, yeah. we're slow roasting. We're, we're, right. we're, we're slow cooking some pork shoulder. I think if. <laughs> Let me see here. Okay, nobody did enters. Nobody All did right, enters. well, this strategy didn't do shit. Yeah. It's fine. I'm sure it's fine, right? 
Oh man, the tires are already cold as cold as ice. You're as cold as ice. Willing to oh, race predictions. We forgot to do race oh, predictions. Oh, right. There's plenty of time. Uh, this is three cars. Okay, there we go. Oof. Somebody's wearing old team colors. Rude. I don't like oh, it. Oh, yeah. Yeah, they are. In this traffic, I feel like the engine mode isn't really getting us anywhere. Yeah. Just save a couple laps of fuel. Uh, I mean, it is. <laughs> All right, now Hold they're on. losing ground. Yeah, they, uh, yeah, I think it was actually doing something. <laughs> it turns out. Oh, Tally made that up though. Good on you, Tally. We're almost in the worst of the rain. Yeah. I think he might need to come up on the fuel to stay in. The people it's weird tally's fucking flying on the low fuel yeah well also softs yeah that's yeah you're right and there was a big difference in performance of the two tires yeah yep but Quintus got passed by three people on mediums which is why i was like his engine needs to come up yeah <laughs> Oh, yeah, it's hard to get those tires, those tire temps up. Look at her go. Crushing it. Now, does our tire wear look pretty bad <laughs> compared to the rest of the field? Maybe. Oh, that's what fast pit stops are for. Yeah. It is funny to me how somehow Wentz managed to slide to dead last while Tally's up in seventh. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh. He's New not fastest the sector. best driver. No. He really Meanwhile, isn't. She's getting better and better as the race goes on. <laughs> yeah. 8.54. Hell yeah. She's loving it. <laughs> loving those chicken sandwiches. <laughs> Gondado, this rain is washing away the shame of the chicken commercials. The, purif the purifying power of rain. Now, now, can we uh, take a peek at the water on track situation for the rest of the... Oh, it's it's drying out. And the sun's beautiful. coming out. Beautiful, beautiful. We love, love it. to see it. <laughs> oh, my God. Tally's just out there tearing it up. The field and her tires. <laughs> 
but uh, you know what? Human and Olin are doing just as bad, just as poorly. On uh. <laughs> there she goes. Nice. Wave goodbye, motherfucker. <laughs> She's on a nine. Oh, don't let him get on the inside there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fuck him up. You own that line. <laughs> Meanwhile, Fuentes. Yeah. <laughs> it sure has, buddy. It sure has. Hey chat, can we get a can we get a quick glyphs? I appreciate you, chat. Soft at ten. Okay. We've got some space. Uh soft's at fifteen. No, you're right. Yeah, you're right at ten. Yeah. What do you think? Two more laps, probably, given the the current wear. Uh, maybe more. Okay, yeah, we'll see what it looks like on the next wrap. So we just just crossed one here. We're at 35, 34, let's say. Yeah. Whoa. Sorry, folks. We need an info-rich display now. <laughs> I don't even know what to do with this information. There's too much information. <clears throat> uh, we're at nine. We've made up two laps so far with our battery. That was at 63%. We'll probably make up another one and a half. Twenty six. Okay, that was a little over ten. So I think next one, she will probably have to come in. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. Let's bring. Let's pet her. Yeah, she won't make a full lap there. Um. Do we switch here to softs and try to last as long as possible? What are the estimated laps on the softs? Not enough to get us there. No. So do we do this really? 16. Uh, we'd be yeah. on 10, right? There's no way to stretch. No, so no. we're going to have to pit once more no matter what. Do we yeah. do a medium stint and then a fast stint? Or do we do a two fasts and then a slow? I feel like That's a good question. I I feel almost like too fast and a slow is the way to go because like traffic's still dense real right now, right? Like, yeah. I feel I'm, like the the medium will do less harm later in the race. I always yeah, it always feels rough because then there's like, what is the field gonna do? Because then maybe you get passed if you're on That's the slower tire. Someone at the says, end. what if we just stay on softs? We run the used softs. Ooh, finish that off. That may still be better. Our best we're not, softs. Yeah. Yeah. I'm I'm into that. I'm into that. I dig that. Top right soft looks like the the um yeah yeah that one up there is probably the one that's least yeah. So we finish the race on that. No no no. I think one the other way two. around. I think we use this you one. Do a short stint now. Yes, and then fresh tire for the last stint, so that we're if other people pit around us as well, and they're also going on fresh tires, we're still in contention with them, right? Hmm. I don't want to be slower at the end, I think. That's what that what my heart is telling me, just off, like, I don't know, instinct, I guess, but... Like, use the used one now for a shorter stint, and then take a longer stint at the end with a yeah. newer tire. Radamara's saying it won't get us there. Sure it will. 
Say she does 11 laps on this. All right, that takes us to lap 20. Seven to nine. She would have, yeah, she can do it. She can, she can do, do it. it. She can absolutely do it. She can do it. She can do it. I trust, I believe. You've done nine on new ones? Yeah, but that was, with full, that was with full load of fuel. Also, going through water and having to push harder. That might have helped, actually, though. The really? water cooling the tires. Yeah, I'm not sure. The I, I can't tell. I, I can't think, well, tell. I, we've, we've been told that them being too cold also affects wear, though. Hey, look, Rodomero, you're about to look like a genius if we fuck this up. Don't worry. <laughs> I believe. Now, the real question is... No, Do we you want to pile it. some risk on this? We don't need it. We don't need it. We might need it. We might need it. No, we've got how many laps out of that the charge? Uh, shoot, we can't see here. Yeah. It was around 63% when you turned it on. And we got at least but four. She's short on fuel. Four laps out of it. Right, but it's going to charge up again. All right. And if we let it go to 100. All right. All right. I think our, I think we're fine. We will have one more chance to pit. Well, we need to have we need to pit one more time, which means we'll have one more chance to charge the battery if it's absolutely necessary. I think we're actually good though. You really want to run the used tire right now? I would run the used tire right now. I would run the used tire right now while everyone else is on also used tires or slower tires. Okay. And then at the end, once everyone's pitted, we go we go with the flow and pit as well. With new tires, fresh tires for the for the last stint. This this makes sense in my brain. I'm sure there's like it could be some theory oh, as to why is... you do the other way around, but Oh man, <laughs> Fuentes, you need to get heat into those tires, bro. Yeah, yeah. Heat in the tires. Right, out of out of these, Claire has done we were at a nine deficit, right? Yeah. We got three out of a 63% uh, battery charge. We just need to do that twice. I think we have enough race to do that twice. Oh, Fuentes is suddenly feeling himself too. Ugh, the tire wear situation. Well, Fuentes got a lot of people pitted. Yeah. Um, 40. You pull them off the tire and he immediately loses a place. It's very funny. Every time we change something and then off screen, yeah. <laughs> Gaspar changes, a, loses a place. Wow. Couple pits there. Huh. Shit, he's burning fuel. He's burning fuel. New. Dally, you gotta come up on the tire a little bit. Come on. I was doing so well, too. And then, yeah, I guess it got cooler. <clears throat> it's kind of, it seems like it's kind of cool today. Like, oh, yeah. what's this? Did we, wait. No, it's just light. It's, it's, it's just a touch. It's just a really light. Yeah, yeah. Just a, this just this a water, not wet. wet. This water, this water wet. not wet. This water, not wet. Is water wet? Legendary form thread. Locked after 25,000 posts. It's 
kind of jumping into the final shape in an hour. I'm jumping into the final shape in two hours-ish. Two and a half, I think is what we said. It's on the schedule. There's a time. Yes, I will be jumping into the final shape later today. A little bit after the exact launch because server reasons, you know. <laughs> Man, Fuentes is losing pace. You want to use up his battery? He, he's going to have to pit in like two two laps, maybe? Oh. Up. Uh, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. I lost your camera. Oh, that's where... You did lose my camera. My camera shot off. Oh no. That's not good. That's not good. Hold on. <laughs> Let me just bounce it. Is it so hot that it just turned off? I wonder. <laughs> uh, it could be one of those days. Ooh, Tally, get past him. Get past him. Come on. Yeah. Uh, but I will need to bounce the. Oh shit. Oh, uh, hang on. Yeah, what's up? Before she comes around, because I think oh, Fuentes is out of place. I'm going to have to bounce the camera. I might need to come back into VMAX real quick. Okay. Sounds good. Ty's about to catch up. Dog eat wall again? No, just just technical issues. <laughs> there we go. Nice. Excellent. All right. Now, uh, I probably should have pitted Fuentes. No, but Fuentes needed to finish. Like, we, he needed to get through this laps. Now, now yeah. he pits, right? Right now? No, he, he's still got the, the cliff on uh, mediums is five, isn't it? Or what did I misread that? Uh, yeah, but his times are trending in the wrong direction. Um, so his last lap that he just completed, uh, was lap 13. So he was doing, uh, so two laps ago, he did a minute 41, uh, 0.5. Uh-huh. And effectively his last lap was, um, was a minute 42. Um, he is, he's a half a second lap off his pace. Right. Is this enough so space? He has gone far enough. Now the one stop is on. All right. Then, yeah. Send I it. think, cause I think he's going to start losing ground if we keep him out much longer than this. Like That's we're fair. not at the cliff, but you don't we, think like we're seeing. I thought that that dip might've may have just been the dampness that happened was what I thought was going on where it rained for like that 30 seconds in the middle of the lap. No, Cicado, because I took these notes uh -huh. on times, these notes uh -huh. are important now. Yeah. These, this is good information. I mean, I'm, well, we just, we're I just applying the, the information. Yes. I took the note <laughs> to see if there's a trend. There's a trend. <laughs> I've identified it. I took the notes. So we should act on that information. Yeah. Because this is a good heuristic. I took that. I, I believe yes. in it. <laughs> yeah, you get me. You get me. Yeah. The we are being data driven. Being real. This is a data -driven. data driven organization here at Oberhof. I, I do think I do think you're right. He's made it 14, so he only needs to do that one once more. He can do it. <laughs> Katie Fox, <laughs> Katie Fox VT, powered by AWS. <laughs> no. Oh, I think you're right though. We we pit him. We pit him. Yeah. Back out on that, yep. He's got a deficit of five. This Maybe is our we... chance, Kata, if we want to just... Yeah, let's just, just give him a little... Yeah. Just a little bit. Just a little... I don't know. And you know what? We're already being risky. Yeah. Why not... Why not go to fast? Aw. No, <laughs> not no, even no. going to look at the time difference. I wanted to see what, what position we would come in. Hit him like an avocado. <laughs> it's a very good. <laughs> oh, I like that. I like that. Hey, look at that. His pace is better. <laughs> Ooh, 
lays a max attack now. Right. Yes, that's like he's using all his tires. He's using all and his form has gone nuts. Holy shit. Yeah, he's he's up there. We're getting this is a rare Fuentes is feeling himself. We're day. piping we we're piping the Gregorian chant into <laughs> his yes! into his headphones. It's like that scene in, <laughs> in Gran Turismo. <laughs> but it's like with Gregorian chant. Yeah. Spectacular. Very nice, very nice. I don't think he has to go all the way off on conserve. Remember, though, we're going to lose heat. Let's see which direction it goes, yeah. I think Tally does one more before we bring her in. Yeah. Uh, Okada, she might need to do more than one. Yeah. It's gonna be twelve laps, right? Uh, I'm the trying last to remember. Lap counts. Yeah. She, so okay, she's so gonna go around the next lap. Yeah, we can pit her. We can pit her. Okay. She needs to go to 18. That, that yeah, seems... Is that true? Is that true? She needs to go to 18? She can do one more. If she does one more, it'll be lap 17. 12 laps. We get us the start of lap 29. Which... Would be the end. Fine. Yeah. There is no lap 29. But, right. Except lap 28 is, you know, it counts. Sure. This is where we always get thrown off. But right, right. I think. We will be entering if laps. She can do, if she can do this plus one, we're golden. But she's, a, she's losing time. Oh, man. She's way off. Yeah, no. I think she has to pit. She has to pit. But also. Mm, yeah, she has to pit. Might as well burn at the end though. Here, right? Turn everything up to the max. Yeah, you know, let's let's see. Hang on. Uh I think she can go around one more time. Yeah, yeah, it's gonna one be more. a little rough. One more for safe. One more for safety. Sure. You asked about end of race weather. Looks good. Do I need to come off the tire, though? At this point. Yes. Well, we're like really playing with that heat thing right now, just to just try yeah. to nurse at home. Yeah. Uh, but I think you're right. Like, we are about to hit that cliff. Dangerously close. We we have to pit now, like on this one. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Twelve. Golden. Looking good. Uh. I've yeah, lost well, track of how she's doing on this. Kind of fine. I think she'll probably make it with what she do naturally, but to be safe. Uh, yeah. Okay. To be safe, Low to chance. be risky. Okay, what's the difference between balance and fast? I just need to know. One one extra position. Estimated. Maybe that's fine. Maybe it's not worth the 9% jump. It might be. Fuck it. Fuck it. We ball. Go big or go home. <laughs> go big or go home. We've said it. <laughs> it's been spoken into the air. Now it must be so.
Oof, you really feel that cliff, huh? Yep. It's fine, we're pitting anyways. All these people would have yeah. passed. It's not the biggest worst time. It was pretty pretty well managed, honestly. As far as uh getting everything we could out of those tires. Awesome. awesome. Sick, 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 sick. Oop. Cancel that. <laughs> Uh, and then three that that all gets taken up if we hit another sixty three percent, right? We don't even need sixty three percent, sixty percent. Oh, she's cooking! Hell yeah! Let her cook. Man, Fuentes struggling. To, the heat in these tires is not great. Like, no. Even pushing both engine and. It's rough out there. Yeah. Is track temperature just fall falling? It has fallen a bit. It's just like maybe the yeah. sun will help. I have no idea. It's bad. Oh, nice. All right. Well. New PB. Don't need to take those notes anymore. Your camera just, died again. We're, oh man, it must be hot as hell. Yeah, yeah. Or something worse is going on. You are sending a bigger image. Did we ever figure that out? Sometimes you yeah, send. Yeah, I a just need to adjust some settings. Yeah. Okay. You send a big image and then you get the frame. All right, I'm gonna let this camera cool. Maybe it will just like. Do we? Yeah. Do you have an image of me? A still from previous? A sort of mimetic. <laughs> Probably find like, is something. There a, I'm sure I'm sure there's something on this computer I can find. Oh, I have a really cursed thing that isn't you. I won't do that. What about Who's number ten on the bulls? Number ten on the bulls? I don't know. There might not be a number ten. It kinda depends. There is a really like crunchy still of me from LA Rob where I'm wearing the sunglasses yeah. during that like table chat. I can't find remember it. where it is. Yeah. I feel like I have that image somewhere. Seems fine. So we should let Tally burn as much as possible on the fuel. Because we still have five point something left. Yeah. Like, like last two laps, so we can turn the battery on. By, by that point, it'd be fine. Last two and a half, I guess. Man, I was hoping that they would make up some ground during the pit cycles, but they're so far back. They've both well, fallen so far back. Well, but also, like, I really expected the first, like, the top seven to have to pit at this point. But I guess they're running it all the way down. I mean, it seems at this point their only option, but they're gonna, I feel like they're gonna hit those cliffs really soon. Yeah, there's no way they did this better than us. No chance. 
No, I mean, look at the tire. I'm just saying, look at the look at the tire wear. No, I know, the, I know, I know. <laughs> but I'm saying, even if they stop, they're not safe to each other. But like, there we go. Fuentes got some positions. There goes Claire. Nice, nice. Okay. I think he has to stay there because otherwise he starts losing tire temperature, right? Yeah, he's got. It, we've got to let it come up a bit more. It's yeah. got to come up a bit more before we. The question is: Are we in a place where we can have him go harder on the engine in hybrid, and we get to the end? I think we might be. Uh, ye almost. Oh. Uh, it's all good. His brakes are failing, but I'm sure it's fine. I think when, as soon as we hit 50%, we'll be fine. Yeah. This is close enough. I think we should be fine at, yeah. this, at this percentage. Give Tally one more lap of charging and then hit, hit yeah. hybrid on, on her. We're in the money. We just hang on now. Stephenson and Blassi, I feel like they have to... If they're not stopping... Which... Maybe, hopefully they stop. If they're not stopping, though, they're gonna lose so much pace at this point. Like, they can't go to zero on the, on the fucking mediums, right? I mean, they can't... Oh, Stephenson, the, Stephenson just the, pitted. They both just pitted. Three of them just but they pitted. But they, we're not going to get them. They, they had too much space. Out. Fuck, they had so yeah. much space. We got one off that, I think. No, we didn't. Almost. No. Not quite. No. That's okay, though. We're in the money. Wentz is going to make money. it. <laughs> Wentz is going to make it. <laughs> oh, my God. Get off our ass, dude. Bro, could you not? Oh, come on. Fuck. You oh, it's the guy in soft. son We're, of a no, bitch. It's, yeah, the, they're pissed. This is what I was worried about with, the, with yeah. the, the whole, like... Yeah, and then at the end, everyone's swapping to softs and shit. And now we're... Yeah. Now we're slower than everyone. Oh, you hate to see it. Yeah. Bro, well, one chance is that if Fuentes keep, Fuente keeps pace, Cruz might be close enough. No. Or maybe. No. It's... Cruz is only two ahead. Cruz, Cruz, if Cruz has to pit on like the second to last lap, because the tires are just too low, we might make up one. Yeah. Oh, we have extra fuel. We have fuel to burn. Yep. Yep. Uh, heard? Yes, chef? Heard, chef. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, seventh, th is seventh is pitting. Seventh is pitting. Let's fucking go. We're back in the money, baby. We're back in the money. Now just don't die in two laps. <laughs> you got this. You got this, Fuentes. <laughs> I believe. We need to pull Tally off the tires. Yeah, yeah, I know. Shit. Tally's gonna just be where she's, she's gonna, gonna be. Yeah. yeah. She's just gonna be where she's gonna be. That's fine. She'll finish the race. This doesn't count as vindication for Rodomero. I just wanna make that fucking clear right now. <laughs> like doesn't count. Doesn't count. Wow. Unless Wait, she I we, turns... I, I thought we did the thing that Radomero asked us to, didn't no, we? No, Radomero didn't think that the, 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 the sauce, the triple sauce was going to work, period. Oh, okay. Uh, it almost worked. It almost worked. Unless she does something unprecedented, like turns a minute 42 and change, I don't, like, Radomero just doesn't... 
is wrong. Wrong. <laughs> wrong, wrong, wrong. Went as in 9.0 form. Absolutely top of his game. Raced his little heart out today. I don't want to think about Tally right now. It's she fine. We sad. don't. Yeah, it's okay. She'll just as long as she finishes the race, I guess. Hey, dude, it is, you it is very sad. Do whatever it is, man. Just like go fucking pull out, hard. pull out, push, 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 overtake, overtake. It's only it's last lap. Yeah, no mercy, no mercy. No Come on, mercy. Bro. You're not losing us a goddamn money. Shit. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. We're still seventh. He's gonna lose it. He's We're still seventh. We're still boosting, seventh. Even if, boosting. even if that's fine, that's okay. Yeah. Oh. We're good. We're in the money. Seventh place is all we needed, baby. Six seventh. points, though. <laughs> Six points. It's fine. We're not in it for points. With our loadout, we're in it for money. We're in it for improvements. Yes, improvements that's true. require money. Does Overhop have any points this year? Tally won us two points at the start of the year. Yeah. You have some points, I guess. Five to eight. Kind of have an awesome idea elite. for increasing remap revenue. Yeah. What if we started taking real money bets on? No, fuck off. <laughs> but then <laughs> you're pretty good at math. You can figure out if, like, we can get some outcomes that pay us more money, and then we are definitely good enough at this game to manipulate those outcomes. Jesus. <laughs> you can't see, people can't see me, I'm pointing at my head. Yeah. This, this is idea. what you're doing? Yeah, uh-huh. It's vision. Rob, your mic is still on. You're still, we're still streaming, we're still live. <laughs> Kick sponsorships, yeah. Fuck off. Ooh, someone got dinged for. <sighs> but not someone who was in a position where we could no. take positions no. off them. Unfortunate. Oh, damn it. And who got fastest lap? Gobert. Gobert. Lawless driving. Not even haters out there. Just everyone's. Oh, no, so somebody loves Tally. Yeah. Oh. Uh. Oh, but it's okay. It's gay. Hey. Yeah, that's true. It's better. <laughs> Happy Pride, everyone. It's, it's not creepy and objectifying <laughs> if it's gay. <laughs> hey, Katrine. You want to see this woman eat a chicken, Sammy? <laughs> Look, we came in six and we were expected eighth. The chairman is pleased. The chairman is pleased. Oh, Bjorn really isn't making any progress, huh? Bam. Look at that. Woo! Hot damn. We made money. A few more weeks like that, we can build a thing. We can build a thing. We can build a thing right now. Oh, but what about, like, I'm thinking, like, Construction. We could break ground. We like, what if we only had to have ground. one year? Of, what if we only had one oh year of God. tanking because we had like so much infrastructure that we built up? That'd be incredible. Yeah. How much does the helipad cost? Uh, da, 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 da. <laughs> Job security. Very the, secure. Yeah. New building. Helipad is expensive. Well, especially because we still have to build. They, haven't, they won't tell us how much it costs, will they? No, we have to build the level two design center, which has happened. Okay. Yeah. We won't know until. Wait, go back to the new buildings tab? Yeah. No, yeah, it doesn't say at all. I bet we it's pretty build. fucking expensive. We could build. We could build soon. Or we just build this. 
It will clear our credit card. This will absorb this. This will clear. This will clear. Maybe not like we don't do the steak. We got to buy some parts, but like soon. Yeah. It'll clear. Okay, Becky. Yes, my friend, as your break seems to be holding the team back. I like that. I like C. He needs to button it. It's very funny. No. Nope. Lanning did not like hearing he needs to invest more. Well, he does, yeah, though. Yeah, truth hurts. <laughs> oh, shoot. I forgot I was looking for an image of you. I got too engrossed in our losing race. <laughs> What do you think, Kato? Half a million to give everyone plus one to pick crew stats. Oh my god. Yeah. We have some 14s, yeah. 13s in there this. that could... Yeah. We can actually afford it. That doesn't even put us in the red. And that's because Scanstrom was like, hey, why don't you just come down and practice? That's awesome. Yeah. Way to go, Scanstrom. They were friends now. Sick. And we're about to get a sponsor. Okay. Hold on. Hold on to your butts. <laughs> we get three, right? So one more. Send wow. it one and look, more Scanstrom let us do that, even though we're neck and neck in the points. Right. Wow. These, these folks rule. That's amazing. Sh shout outs. Oh, that's because that's because Maddox is networking. Oh. I bet you that's it. Oh, yeah, totally. Uneasy. Yeah, that ain't good. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> oh, yeah. Car repair complete. These are not, uh, These are not hot. I guess. I mean, this is easy money. Yeah, why are these so low? Why are we getting two star sponsors? I don't, want... I don't know. Is it because I of our... want to let it expire. Yeah, is it because but... of our target... Ex 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 is it because of how lowly know. we've been... Oh my god. Hang on. Let's crunch the numbers real quick, because, like, yeah. say we... Because the thing is, this one at least expires sooner, right? That's three races sooner than it expires. Right. So let's let's say we took that deal every time. We, we can reliably hit 12th or above, I think. Uh, I'm six. 1.5. Okay. 1.8 million total if we get it every single time. Yeah. Um, I think the other one is technically better money, but it lasts longer. More, yeah, it's definitely more. But it's a lot more money. It's a lot more money. And it's like, do we just let these expire for two races and not run anything? Yeah, I mean... Or do we just go Golden Tiger? Welcome, welcome to the team. Golden Tiger's a lot more overall. So these are the folks, third or above, we're not doing that, second or above. Oh, this not is replacing point. play sport. That's what it is. Yeah, yeah, play sport. Play sport, come back. Play sport, where did you go? Play sport, save me. I think play we sport. should do Golden Tiger then. <laughs> I think we're just stuck and yeah. we gotta do it. Yeah, I think it's the most money and most upfront and then most overall if you take it, which we should probably I think that's what yeah. we want. we're taking all the time. Alright, and Oh No, it's gotta be the camera that's failing. Hang on here. I was like, what is there a chance that it would be the, um, 
the cable, except the display on the camera is also turning off when it cuts. Yeah, it must be, um, I think heat is a good call, honestly. Yeah, but it's never, <laughs> this thing has been pretty rugged through some pretty hot weather. So, Interesting, I'm like, huh? a little bit weirded out by that, like... I found a good image. You found a good image? Yeah. Speed, acceleration, acceleration. Okay. Everyone remembers Coffee Coon, right? What? Is that me? You're, That's uh, a random meme. It's a cup of coffee. Yeah, it's you. Where is this from? I don't remember when or why I made this, but I made it was in our streaming stuff, and I remember making it. <laughs> I don't remember Coffee Coon. <laughs> I, I think I made it at the same time I was making Carrot Coon. I had to pixelate the logos on that cup for an obvious reason. Nice. Everything has a fair bit of headroom on... This is the rare case where it almost feels like having improvements in roughly in balance is actually the move here. Yeah. That is how it feels to me. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Uh, probably. I don't know. I feel like. You the feel risk still feel a little more liability. The riskier thing is, yeah, because that engine, that engine, yeah. It needs to be over a certain amount, just yeah. through regular wear and tear. And the numbers are like all of these numbers are better than what we already have, right? Yeah. As far as like That's performance, true. so it's like performance has to come second because it needs to be usable. <laughs> Needs to be usable first. <laughs> I don't think Honest, I can. I don't let... think I can let people see, <laughs> see watching this stream. What's wrong with? Is it just? Is it? Is it the? Is it that that weird avatar is blushing? It's not blushing. Or is it the Betty Davis eyes situation. Coffee Coon isn't blushing. I don't know what y'all are talking about. People think Coffee Coon is blushing. Oh, Kado Senpai. <laughs> okay, well. <laughs> so, what I'm saying here uh -huh. is we got a million dollars. Yeah. And that could be a lot of things. It could be a lot of things. Like a new engine? But also, things could clear. <laughs> things could clear. Honestly, Our gearbox is so bad. Our gearbox is we, so bad. Okay, let's, let's stagger through one more weekend, right? And then break you, ground on this thing. You don't think it clears now? Get started on... I mean, it's going to take a while to build. I think, I think it clears, but I think we can get yelled at. We can get yelled at. Trouble isn't real. You can't get in trouble. <laughs> Trouble's fake. <laughs> How long would it take to build? Oh. Oh, I have the best idea. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I mean, like. It would take 20, 20 weeks. weeks, right? We have to start. How many weeks are left in the season? Not that many. Only divided by four is five months. 
It's not it, we're it's not gonna be ready by the end of this season. Yeah. So it's like the earlier we can break ground on it, the the better. Well, but it could get done in the off season. And there is no off season. Right no, there is. How much? There is. It's like, like one construction like, gets finished. Like three months. Let's let's build this in Wait, is November the last one? I thought we had like We could build the hang on. If November's the last one and the first one was in March, that means we have Well and hang on, it's not even June. It's only three months. What is today's date? It's May. We can get this done before the end of the season. And use it like once at the end? Yeah. I mean, yeah. Yeah. This is the thing. Yeah. Start earlier. Start earlier is absolutely what I'm saying. I'm with you on this. Trouble isn't real. Trouble isn't real. <laughs> I say closing my eyes <laughs> and hitting build on the telemetry center. <laughs> Trouble is only real if they can fire you. And I don't think they can fire us. If it clears, it clears, is really the thing. Yeah. 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 <laughs> oh, and boss. <laughs> We're going to be needing a new, a new something. Uh,. Did we go engine? Our suspension's already good. We have such yeah, good suspension. But, look at look right, at our. But we could, yeah, but we could like lean. It. It's, the thing is, it's cheap, right? Like we we could have a great suspension, yeah, and it's cheap. I guess. But we need better gearboxes always. I guess it's just improvements from here on out on the gearboxes. I think we can build just one one suspension. Just let just this one suspension. Let me have one suspension. Okay. And fucking a. Yeah, it doesn't do anything. Uh. Wait, it doesn't. Oh, great! Yeah, great great components. components. Um. Fifteen to max. Five thirty. I think the left one is yeah, the best the option, right? One. Yeah. The first one. Yeah, it's like hands down the best one. It's just one. two extra days of... Yeah. Yeah. This is fine. That's nothing. Thanks, Mariana Romero. Hey, have we been scouting people for that position, by the way? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, here's the thing, Kata. Yeah. I actually think we're in a really good place because we have a cheap-ass engineer. Like, we'll hide... Once we've built good facilities then we get the engineer to build yeah it. yeah yeah okay. right now it's the fact she's like making shit money <laughs> that is enabling us to go on this spree that's fair that's fair all right the pit crew is looking a little little ragged uh yeah now's the time to swap but also everyone got bonuses that's so good 17 we, we've never seen a 17. <laughs> we need someone with tires. Tires, tires. Valentia, love, love that. Uh, uh, Adu needs to go. Uh, Rova Rove? is perfect. Rova. We got Schluters out here. We got uh, Schluters. I think Bystrick might need to rest. Wait, can you swap uh, Stommer and Rosero? Does that work? How important is Jax, really? Oh no, I didn't see Stommer's fixing. I was looking at the wrong number. My bad, my bad. 
Uh, I think it's Rosero had had to go up there. Oh wait, what? We can live with this. We can live with this. Sure. Yeah, that seems fine. Wait, can we use Beasel for what? Nah, I guess 80 is like not really. Ooh, hey. Ah, uh, the Ooh. numbers aren't great though. Yeah. I just saw 96 and I was like excited. <laughs> yeah, I know, but it just ain't much. It's not much. It's not much. Oh, we, we, remember, we want to reject people. Yeah, this whole crew kind of sucks. Yeah, it's fine. It's fine. We'll, we'll find someone. We'll find someone. We'll find someone. Anyone getting close to being terminated? Because I feel like there was at least one person we were going to let the clock run down, and we just didn't give a shit. Yeah. Ah. Uh... <laughs> All right, so we're going to get a mean email. And we're just gonna be prepared for that. It's not gonna throw us. It's not gonna throw us at all. It's gonna be great. We didn't get yelled at yet. We didn't get yelled at. Did Did Leonine not notice? I don't think so. <laughs> Getting in trouble's not real! Oh, uh -oh. Here we go. <laughs> Got it. Got it, buddy. Not mad enough to change that, but just just angry enough to be like, hey. Yeah. Cut it out. Hey. None of that, you hear? Hold on a second. No worries. What's up? That's somebody who's calling in from the, from the outside. <laughs> All right. I think we're good. We will just have to get through this race. Yeah. It'll be fine. Yeah. All right. I think on that note, we are good to call it a day here. Take a break. Get you ready for the final shape. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I didn't. I did not see the time. I was I was yeah. too busy trying to get the. Uh, uh, coffee coon to start talking uh, yeah i almost got there <laughs> no. i was like five more minutes and we would have had damn would've next would've had time you. maybe we'll let look it's gonna be a long summer it's gonna be a long hot summer coffee yeah. coon will talk before, the, coon before the may summer return. Is out. <laughs> um yeah i ironically i have to take the car into the shop um annoyingly i'm away to furiosa uh i just clipped the edge of a traffic island no uh, making it's one of those like two left turns off the expressway ramp and anyone, did anyone I was... see it pardon did anyone see it everyone saw it you were witnessed yeah i'm sure oh <laughs> yeah yeah witness me <laughs> uh yeah i'm sorry no it's you know, it like you got you got someone <laughs> making the left yeah off to your right and you get squeezed so you give a little room Ooh. and i just like tagged the island Ooh. and like it. it the rim has a ding yeah the sidewall has a cut but it's like superficial but it's the sidewall so i don't feel good about like i need someone to look at that yeah. and tell me that like that it's tire okay. is good or it's not right 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 just to be sure just to just yeah. to be sure <laughs> Tabasco <sighs> da Gama. That is how I felt when I tagged that. When I tagged that curb, I did feel like mediocre. Oh, <laughs> uh, I've, I've right. been hearing good things. I need to go see that one. I you like do. the first one. You do. It's Great. it's legit worth it. Great. I just bawled uh, my eyes out on the fucking sidewalk after seeing. I saw the TV glow instead this weekend. Nice. <laughs> I also, I did not ball my eyes out after Furiosa. <laughs> I felt, felt elevated. I was like, I want to do road battles. <laughs> it's time. It's time. I, to be clear, 
I had the I hit I clipped that curb before on my way to see Furiosa. I wasn't like flooring oh. it on the way home like to Mad Max. Damn, it. No, it was, you didn't Mad no, Max it. Was, it. No, it was very chill. <laughs> uh, but all right, so we'll be back with this. Uh, you know, probably sometime next week. Yeah, Kata's gonna be back with that just, final shape. Just, yeah, the well, shape could be, it could be a tri- It could be like a triangle. Could be. I think a... we're thinking multi-sided polygon of some sort. You know. Yeah, yeah, like or a polyhedron. Hedron. Yeah, yeah. The decahedron's yeah. a pretty maybe, good one. Maybe it's like one of those like fourth-dimensional shapes that you can't even really like. Oh, the ones that are like constantly yeah. moving. Yeah, exactly. Like, like a cube exactly. folding in on itself. You love to see it. Yeah, we we hate it, but we love it. It's fascinating. <laughs> Who knows? Maybe it's a Mobius strip. It could be. Ooh. Uh, Kata will find all that out after after lunch. Bye.